Sir? Yes. A Major Robert Rogers from New York to see you, sir. Major? That's a letter of introduction from your friend, John andre Ah, well, the, the famed Robert Rogers needs no introduction. Welcome to Satucket. Uh, this man here is our local magistrate, Richard Woodhull. Major, it's an honor. Yeah. Thank you, Richard. Now, you must be tired after your journey. Perhaps you would like to rest or have a proper discussion over dinner. Hear about the business in Connecticut. I should like to question your officers who ran the raid. Uh, they are dead, sir. Not all of them. Captain Simcoe is still missing. Then I should very much like to question him. It says there that you're to give me what I require so that I may find the chalker who left me there. Yes. I did wonder why a cap at the Queen's Rangers was found at the ambush. It was left for me by a young cavalryman who felled one of my men. And 19 of mine. All by himself? Obviously not. How many of them was there, then? Ah, oh, you don't know, because you didn't count the tracks. And you buried the bodies that could tell us the tale except for them high-born lads who paid for passage back to London town. Upon reflection, I do not believe I shall be able to host dinner tonight. Please accept my apology. You fancy that I wish to spend one more hour than necessary in this clammy province? I should like to question your officers. Here they are. Oh, pickled and rum. The barrels are sealed. Not for long. You said only three were recovered. Who's the fourth? That would be Captain Joyce. Who in hell's Captain Joyce? He was a troubled officer. He was found murdered in a field here last week. I'm examining the situation very closely. His death is not connected to theirs and should be no concern of yours. Oh. So you think it bad luck, then, his murder so close to theirs? I think a coincidence, yes. Coincidence? I've seen all manner of strange things in this life, but never one of those. Now, why don't you tell me all about troubled Captain Joyce? 